So I read all through that contract that they forced us drivers to sign to continue driving on the lift platform. And you know, another reason why I just hate and despise the fact that I have to drive for Lyft for the time being. Um, they're able to put in words to try to get away with um, stealing more money from us. Because in that contract, I didn't see anything about them charging passengers for priority pickup and being allowed to automatically switch us to somebody who pays for priority pickup without paying us anything extra. And the reason why I'm frustrated today and now is because it's just started the shift off, $9 streak, um, started at 11 a.m. And I get my first pickup, it was for an $8 pickup bonus. The pickup was nine miles away. I never do nine mile pickups, but I, I was gonna do it because it's an $8 pickup bonus. So I'm headed to the pickup. I drive about four and a half miles towards the pickup and then I get switched. And the reason why, usually they give you either a higher rated passenger or a higher paying fare. That's what they gave me, higher paying ride. So they switched me to an airport ride and more than likely if this scheduled ride that originally I accepted with the $8 pickup should have been for at least $15. My market is so terrible and trash in regards to rate, pay rate. We get 60 cent per mile and nine cent per minute and a 90 cent booking fee. So if the airport ride was a higher paying ride, more than likely, mind you, the the airport was a nine mile pickup. So I was gonna now drive a total of 13, going on 14 miles uh, for nothing because I lost the pickup bonus. But this pick, this airport ride had to be at least a half an hour ride because of the fact uh, a half an hour, 20 miles only pays like 16, $17. So that was the only way this ride was, was higher paying. And it's just scummy that Lyft does that because of the fact, because I'm on the way to another ride, by them switching me, they don't have to show destination, you know, if it's 30 plus minutes away or 45 plus minutes away. So I would have been stuck on one of those long rides because of the fact that the airport is raining right now. When I pull up and click arrive and see that the person's going far away, I don't be having enough time just to pull off on the people because half of the time the people know that we don't want those rides. So they try to hurry up and hop in. And by then, it's like, what do I do, you know? Do I be a dick and just pull off on them or do I stop and let it be? But yeah, just hate it. Lyft just just the worst. And as we're speaking, I get another 10 minute pickup that I'm not doing. <sighs> Something gotta give. I think a class action suit is gonna happen with these um, uh, priority pickups because of the fact they're literally charging passengers four to $10 extra for priority pickup. They're switching us to these rides and they're not paying us a dollar a cent more you know they're just uh and they're making up bs excuses on why they're switching the ride when we're in the middle of another ride that we accepted we actually accepted the ride i don't i don't see i don't see i didn't see anywhere in the contract that they're allowed to automatically switch our rides without our permission but if one of you guys on this reddit sees it let me know let me know if i'm just completely wrong if i shouldn't be frustrated at it but that's all i got for now i'm out